Hey there, West Dove with Dove Development and Consulting. Not so long ago in the series, I, I shared some thoughts on why it's so important for us as leaders to have a crystal clear purpose that we can latch onto on a daily basis. And I also talked about why it's so important for us to be able to communicate that purpose to our teams as much as we do for ourselves. Now, we'll come back to the teams part soon. Right now, we're really digging into the idea for us as leaders, how do we do it? So one of the things I wanna challenge you to think about here is why do you do what you do? And I, I, we walked through that in a little bit more detail recently, but I'll, I'll challenge you to keep that out in front of you. And we recently also looked at how we're wired and how that really um, impacts the way we pursue our purpose. And, and that whole idea of why do we do what we do, how those things are so interconnected. Right now, what I want to do is really insert the idea of keeping our purpose top of mind on a day in, day out basis. And, and in transparency, it really boils down to the right systems. And, and what I want to do, if you'll dig into this with me, wherever you access the rest of the resources I've got put together, you'll see how I share some examples of the systems that I've used to help me work through things in a, on a day to day basis to get the results I need to have fulfillment to really reach my purpose. But the other part that I'll caution you on is my system and your system may not be the same thing. So really look and dive into that for you, not just um, try to cookie cutter for, for, for what works for me and try to apply the same thing. The next thing that we need to look at is how can we, once we figure out all the things that we've got to do ourselves, what are the things that demand our time? How can we prioritize them? to make sure that we're getting the right things in first that give us the best results and really do help us capture that fulfillment, reaching that purpose that really means what it needs to for us so we can carry the the, the weight that comes with leadership. And, and that really boils down to that's the piece that helps us keep our tank full when we can identify where do we get that fulfillment? What's that reward we need in just about everything we do? It all kind of comes together. Now, what we're going to do soon is really dive into that fulfillment, but what are the things we love? And it's unrealistic to say, hey, we can love everything we do every single day. That's not the way the world works. Life doesn't. What we're going to do next is really dive into what percentage do we need to have to make sure we get that right fulfillment? And how do we grind our teeth through the other things, but really push through and get those big results when we can live in that space as leaders to chase that purpose that gives us the fulfillment and soon we'll change gears to really dive into what are, what do our teams really need and expect from us so we can serve them at a high level and give them that purpose give them to the connection to that purpose that feeds them while we achieve great results together hope this serves you well and oh by the way if you've never done it i challenge you to work through the assessment on our site wherever you're accessing this there's a link that you can work through to, to identify what are the things that might be killing profitability in your organization that you can take action on right away and capture that profitability back so you can serve your folks better, so you can serve your communities better and so on. And you may even look for the new book that we've got coming out, or maybe by the time you're seeing this, it is out called What's Killing Your Profitability? It all boils down to leadership. Hope this serves you well. Look forward to hearing your feedback and, and seeing what you could do to make an impact on your teams. Make it a great day. And God bless. Thank you.